infiltrated the bank's computer room, but just as he reached the mainframe, Anna suddenly appeared with a gun. It wasn't until Mike explained that he was here to remove the virus. Anna was taking a breather, but the head of security had barely cleared the virus when he arrived at the server room. Mike knew that the chief had been paid by the boss woman, so he put his life on the line to stop him. He wouldn't let him near the mainframe. With the virus successfully removed, the director turned his gun on Anna. In the nick of time, Mike pushed Anna out of the way. Two bullets are deflected. The police rush into the engine room to stop the supervisor from shooting Mike. Mike was taken to hospital in an ambulance. He was taken to hospital in an ambulance expecting to be treated for his injuries. Mike was expected to face justice. Instead, the ambulance disappeared in the middle of the road. When Mike woke up in a daze, he found himself in a strange environment. Everyone here was one of the top hackers in the industry, and the looks on their faces seemed to welcome him. And that's when, a man with a skull tattooed on his arm slowly approached. Mike took a good look. It was Jack, the bank's head of cybersecurity, who had been killed earlier. Hey bro, welcome to Digital Karma. 